Here's every interval demonstrated at once. Now that that's out of the way, let's take the C major scale. If we start on C and call that one, move to the next step and call that two. That's just a second. If we go from the first step to the third step, that's a third. If we go to the fourth step, that's a fourth. Fifth step, that's a fifth. The sixth step, sixth, seventh, octave. You take pretty much any one of those and make them minor. How about a second? Let's take that first note, the second note, that's our major second, but if we make that second flat, now we have a minor second. Do the same thing to the third. Make that flat, we got a minor third. Let's try the fourth. Make that flat, now we just have a third. That might be why we call it a perfect fourth. Except the perfect fifth, because that can be made flat as well. So we don't really call that a minor fifth, we just call it a tritone. Why a tritone? Well, because it's three whole steps. What is a whole step? This note to the next note? No, that's actually a half step. One whole step is actually two steps, but two half steps, so two halves make a whole. Whole step, whole step, whole step. Three, tone, tritone. That's a little bit about tritones, but there's actually a whole lot more to it than that. Here's the chart.